The first Catholic school in South Carolina was founded by Bishop John England in 1822. It was called the Philosophical and Classical Seminary of Charleston, and it was for boys aged seven years and older. It was later separated into a seminary and an academy. Because there were not enough priests to teach or enough funds, the school was closed in 1837 and the seminary in 1851. The Sisters of Charity of Our Lady of Mercy and the Ursuline Sisters were involved with Catholic education since the early days of the diocese. Both religious orders were committed to providing learning opportunities for children from all backgrounds. The Ursulines opened several schools for young women. In 1835, they created the Free Black Children's School. During this time, South Carolina had laws that outlawed the teaching of people who were black, whether they are slaves or free. Because of this, the school had to close one year after it opened. The Ursuline Sisters also created the Ursuline Academy and the Academy of Immaculate Conception in Columbia, which later became Cardinal Newman School at St. Peter's Catholic School. In the upstate, Father Andrew Keen Gwynn, pastor at St. Mary's Church, invited the Ursuline Sisters to establish Sacred Heart Academy, which later became St. Mary's Catholic School. The Sisters of Charity of Our Lady of Mercy began their teaching mission in Charleston by opening the Academy of Our Lady of Mercy in 1830. It was a day school and a boarding school that offered a basic education. The Sisters also opened St. Mary's Free School in 1839 for young girls who could not afford the Academy's tuition. After Bishop Henry P. Northrop became our fourth leader in the diocese, Bishop England High School was founded and a new parochial school system was established. The high school opened in 1915 in downtown Charleston with Father Joseph Doc O'Brien as its principal. Three Sisters of Charity of Our Lady of Mercy taught 54 students in that first year. The new school system allowed free education for Catholic children and included minorities. In 1903, Immaculate Conception School opened to serve the black community in Charleston. Bishop Northrop asked the Sisters of Charity of Our Lady of Mercy who oversaw Immaculate Conception to take charge at St. Angela Academy in Aiken, one of the first Catholic schools in that part of the state. Between 1958 through 1970, the National Civil Rights Movement had a lasting impact on Catholicism. Bishop Hollinan integrated all Catholic education St. Anne Catholic Church, run by the Oratorian Brothers in Rock Hill, was the first school to take this step. The other schools integrated later. The process went smoothly and peacefully in comparison with other parts of the country. Today, there are 33 schools in the Diocese of Charleston, with about 7,000 students. In addition to faith formation, Catholic education in South Carolina strives to provide a meaningful, engaging learning experience for children. Our Catholic schools bring children closer to Christ and benefit our greater community by teaching them the importance of being one family in faith.